Letcher County Sheriff's Deputy Lieutenant Burt Sloan said Wednesday was a difficult day at Letcher County Central High School. Two students were arrested after two other students were taken to the hospital after the group smoked synthetic drugs at school using an electronic cigarette. The names of the students taken to the hospital were not released. The two arrested, Dylan Cates of Irvine and Kevin Adkins of Whitesburg, both 18, are facing criminal charges. Adkins is facing a misdemeanor charge of possession of a synthetic cannabinoid, while Cates is facing felony charges of trafficking in a controlled substance within 1,000 feet of a school and two counts of first-degree wanton endangerment. Lieutenant Sloan said students and staff at the school were shaken by the event. Because they were terrified. And, you know, I want the teachers to know that I understand that they were terrified. He added that the use of an e-cig to smoke synthetic drugs adds yet another complication in the fight to keep drugs out of school and out of the hands of students. Vape, vape machines are prohibited in school. The children are not allowed to have them. It seems like we're always playing catch up to find out exactly what's going on out in the community. Uh, that uh, you're seeing different methods of using drugs, you're seeing different kinds of drugs, and, and you're trying to play catch up. Sloan said staff members at Letcher Central are diligent and have had success working to keep drugs at bay at the school. Wednesday's incident is a reminder that the fight will go on. We've tried to be extremely vigilant on fighting the drug problem uh, at the high school. To say that, you know, there's not drugs in the school, that would be a, a bad statement. And the response that I've had out of the administrators and the central office personnel at Letcher County Central has always been one in response to try to, one, you want to be proactive as much as possible. But when you do have to react, uh, I've always felt like that I've had their support. Both of the students hospitalized Wednesday were treated and released from Whitesburg ARH Hospital. Reporting in Letcher County for EKB News, I'm Chris Anderson.